No, um, I think you do have the wrong number. My name's Jalissa. It, it's okay. You have a nice day. Bye. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be filming for you guys a kind of video that I look for a lot on YouTube and it's haul videos. I often find myself YouTubing videos of these clothing stores that aren't held here in the United States but that are international that sell really cute clothes but sometimes I don't know what size I'm going to be because it's usually, you know, from a different country so I'm not exactly sure how their clothing is made so I always look for videos of people here in the United States that shop online at their at these places and see kind of their reviews so that I can base myself off of those once I'm buying my own things. So today's video is going to be on a clothing store called boohoo.com. I've seen this store all over Instagram and finally it came to the time where I was like, you know what? I'm going to buy some stuff because they always have a sale. That's the most amazing thing. It's usually 40%, but if you get lucky, sometimes it's 50%. And of course, it's always on select items, but the select items are a huge selection. So I hope you guys continue watching if you're interested. And I'm also going to give you guys a little bit of tips on how to choose your clothing size and all of that jazz. So keep on watching and I'll see you guys in a little bit. So the first category of items that I'm going to show you are dresses. This is a Boohoo night dress. Uh, at least that's what it's called here. And this is in the US size 4 and I think it's UK size 8. It's a bandage dress and it's this kind of burgundy reddish color. I was kind of hesitant to buy this because you never know what kind of bandage bandage dresses are when they're not super expensive. It's like you think about well, you're gonna get what you pay for, but in reality, this I really love how this fits me. The zipper does go all the way up to the sweetheart neckline and all the way down to the dress, but I really like how it fits. It's a really nice material, and it has this really deep sweetheart neckline, and I really like this dress. I think it was a good choice, um, although that it is pretty low cut, but you know what? You can always work around that. The second dress that I'm going to show you guys is one of my favorite ones. This is like a dusty rose pink color and it is a size also US 4, UK size 8. And it, ha it this one's considered a slinky dress. It is really like, you know, jiggly. I don't know if that's the correct word, but it is really loose. And it also has this really nice draped neckline. It does drop down kind of low though and the straps are kind of large and they, they're not adjustable so that's kind of like a bad thing about it. But I do feel like this is the kind of dress that shows everything. Every like little like lump of fat like you know Spanx would be good with a dress like this but I really do love this. The next dress I'm going to show you guys is this really nice silky dress. It's not actually silk by the way but you know neither is my background. <laughs> Just kidding. No, it really isn't. So this one is in a size, US size 6. So it would be UK 10, I believe. This kind of dress gives off the vibe that you're wearing, like, you know, your man's shirt as a dress. And it's really nice, actually. I've gotten a lot of compliments on this. The other two dresses that I showed you before I haven't worn yet, but this one I've worn a couple times to work. And I get a lot of compliments on it, especially from old people and, like, older men. So I'm like, um... Thanks. This next dress I haven't worn either, but it's also another Boohoo night dress. And this one is in the size UK 10, US 6. And this one also has a very deep sweetheart neckline. It's burgundy red. And this material is, I don't even know what material this is, but it's, the, it's a kind of material that I'm not really a fan of. But in this dress, it actually makes it look really sophisticated. And, um... I'm going to have to work around the sweetheart neckline because it's too deep for me, it's too revealing, but I do really love this dress. Okay, so the next dress that I have is kind of like a sleeping dress, like for bed. This is what it looks like. Um, the reason that I got this was not to sleep in it because I don't like sleeping in uncomfortable clothing, but I got this because I wear a lot of suits and stuff, and I think that just the detailing in the front, even though it is a dress, I feel like it's short enough to tuck in to like a suit pant and layer over a suit jacket over it and this detailing would be just so cute without making me look like you know an old lady who's trying to I mean you know a younger girl who's trying to be like an old lady so that's the reason that I got this not to sleep in it but you can sleep in it 
And finally, the last dress that I'm going to show you guys is another Boohoo Night dress. This one is in a size US 6 and UK 10. This one is pretty revealing, but when I saw it on the model, I was like, I loved this dress, except for the fact that it doesn't look on me how it looks on the model because I'm shorter. It's too deep cut for me, and I think that a tank top kind of ruins it. The open leg is too open for me. But I'm sure that I could work around it and I still love this dress. I haven't worn it yet, but when I find a way to wear it, I will. The next two items that I'm going to show you are just like some jackets. This one is a one size fits all and it's a really pretty, you know, mauve colored duster. I really love this for work because you can just like wear a tank top and throw it over and you already look dressed up. And it has this nice little thin belt with it so it doesn't like overdo it. It's not too thick. It's just the perfect size. The next one is this bomber jacket. This bomber jacket is in a size UK 8, US size 4. What grabbed my attention about this jacket are the shoulders. Isn't that cool? It's just so open. It's not just like a little cold shoulder. It's like a huge cold shoulder. It does look really silky, so it doesn't make you look like you're trying too hard to be a hipster or to be urban. But it does have that, you know, swag to it, so I like that. The next three items that I'm going to show you guys are tops. And I'm going to start off with this sweater. I really liked this sweater when I saw it online because the girl that was wearing it, well not the girl, the model that was wearing it, it just looked so cool on her. It has it has this really nice detail on the side, kind of like, I was going to say caged, it's not caged, is it? Zigzag, I don't know. Oh, I knew the name of it too. I just can't think of it right now. But it's pretty large on me. I got this so I could pair it with a leather skirt that I bought from another another store. But I think that I did make a mistake when I got to this size. I should have gotten a size smaller. This next shirt that I have, I've been wanting for a really long time. Um, I just wanted like a shirt that had this like attached choker to it. And I thought, oh, this is a perfect time to get it. It's okay. It wasn't my favorite when I wore it. But once again, just like the other shirt, I, I think the black one, I think I got a size too big. This one, I think I got a size too small. I got this one in a size small medium. I should have gotten it in a size medium large because it's a high low top so on the front it's low and on the back it's pretty long the side cutout kind of shows my belly and that I don't just I didn't really like that so yes I do like the shirt but I honestly think that I should have gotten a different size but you know what you live and you learn I almost forgot I bought one skirt from Boohoo and this is what it looks like the reason that I bought this skirt was because I had found previously a military green sweater that I really wanted to wear with, you know, a kind of tan skirt. So when I was shopping online, I was like, well, maybe Boohoo might have one now that I'm already here. So I looked for it and I found this one that has ridges on the side. I really like this crunched up detail because I feel like it's really flattering on, you know, both curvier bodies and slimmer bodies. So this is definitely an A++++ for me. I love this skirt and I got this one in a size US 4, UK 8. So that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching as much as I enjoyed recording. I feel like this video came a lot more naturally to me because I love clothing so much and I love being of assistance to anybody who's interested in shopping from places like Boohoo. This video is not sponsored, but I decided to do it because I really have loved Boohoo and everything that I bought from there. Anything that I haven't loved is simply because of the sizing that I've chosen incorrectly, but other than that, everything is fab and at a really good price. So if you guys enjoyed this video or found it helpful at all, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that thumbs up. Share this video with your friends and your family. And comment down below if you have any advice for me about shopping at boohoo.com because I love to learn from you guys as much as I love to share with you guys my experiences. I hope you guys have an amazing day and I'll see you next time.